Hey, what's up, guys? Nintendo Jaden here, and welcome back to some more Super Mario Galaxy. Um, yeah, in the last episode, we completed uh, Bowser for the first time in the fountain, and in this galaxy, we are going on to the newly opened dome called the kitchen. And we are going to the first galaxy of this dome, which is Beach Bowl Galaxy. So let's do this. Finally, on a new dome! Uh, should I fix the camera? Yeah, I think I should. Anyways, first mission is Sunken Treasure. That's good. Alright! Alright, one second, guys. Alright, guys, I think this is good. Camera looks good. Wake up, Mario. Alright, so. My goal is to get, like, all the stars we can in this episode, so. Um, I think, and my recording device, I think I can record for a pretty long time. Um. Let's see. Yeah, like, 30, uh, at least a half an hour. And, oh my god. Get up there, Mario. Go. I'm gonna go in here, cause this is where you can get your star bits. Ta-da! Try to break a, don't break the bricks. See, I didn't break any there. And all of these star bits, yeah. And a Goomba. Wow. Okay, guys. Anyways, how are y'all doing? I'm doing okay, I guess. Another lame day of school, I suppose. And, as always, expect an, an episode of 3D Land tonight. But, we have to look for sunken treasure now. Sunken treasure is basically star chips in the ocean. So... Don't get really interested. It's just starships. Okay, I'm gonna save that for last. Let's go and get this one over here. I try to set up the camera as best as I can, so hope you guys enjoy. There we go. Three. Need one more. I'm gonna look over here. There's four. Now if we go over here. Back over here. Oh, out of my way. Oh my god. There we go. Oh my god. Get the star chip. There we go. Oh my god, I don't like this. There we go. Okay. I'm not gonna hit this. It just makes music notes appear. Spoilers. <laughs> God dang it! Awesome. Here we go, let's do this. There we go! Didn't even need the switches. There we go. Awesome! Mission 2, passing the swim test. Now this mission is really, really easy. All you gotta do is get the gold shell under the water. So, pretty straightforward. But first, before we do anything else, I will go get the star bits in that pipe. Because you get a lot over there. So I'll see you guys when I'm done that. Alright guys, I'm done that now. 
You're gonna go talk to this guy, which is the teacher. I, I suppose. So, you're obviously gonna wanna get an A, cause, you know, we're not known for being smart or anything. But yeah, go get the gold shell, which isn't really easy. I, I mean, is really easy, not isn't really easy. It is actually pretty easy, this mission takes like one minute. Not even. And then just go show it to this guy's face. Okay. So, that's obviously a power star, not a gold medal. And why would you have that? You stole that star from the observatory. You meanie. Okay. I'm not one of your students, so... You suck. <laughs> I like throwing the shell in his face. It's funny. You got a star. Mission 3. The secret of... No. The Secret Undersea Cavern. So, yep, yeah, this is Mission 3. Alright. This mission is kind of challenging, but not really. Anyways, I will see you guys when I go get those star bits again. Over here. So, peace out. Alright, guys, here we go. Now, I'm back. So, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna grab a shell, and you're gonna break the rules. Um, what the heck? Um, if you go up and talk to the teacher, or any penguin, I think, they're gonna say, don't break the crack in the wall. So, you're gonna have to do that to get a power star, so, go break the rules. Yeah. Suck, you dumb bat. What are you doing, stupid Goomba? Goombas think they're tough, but they are not. Ta -da. Ta da! And now we're here. Now, quickest route. Um, yeah, the power star is like somewhere. Oh god, my cursor is being so lame. Be very careful and don't get squashed. Oh yeah, you can, when you're, they're about to like drop like on their jaw, you can hide under their mouth. So... And there's a thwomp that looks nothing like those whatever they are. Actually don't know what they are. Mission 3 is completed. Get the star. We got a star. Fast foe comet in orbit! Alright, this is mission four, I think. Fast foes on the cyclone stone. Oh, so that's what it was called. Anyways, this is, I believe, our first fast foe mission. Like I explained before, fast foes are basically when your foes are fast, pretty much. See, all my foes are, like, way faster. It's crazy. Now, long jump, like, when it's coming back, kind of. Kind of hard to explain how to do the shortcuts, but I know you guys can pull the shortcuts off. It's funny, this episode's gonna be like 12 minutes. I would, I'd still have enough time for recording. It'd be funny if I completed one dome in one episode. <laughs> I might do that in like, oh god. No, are you kidding? Okay, guys, I'm back. Alright, let's do this. Okay. Okay. I got scared.
it for a minute. Too fast for me. Too slow, I meant. Or whatever. But there we go. And that is the fourth uh, star, I believe. Alright guys, back at mission 3, there is a secret star in this mission, so we're going to go ahead and get that, but as always, first, I'm going to go here, so I'll see you guys when I'm done. Alright guys, now I'm done in that thing, you did not want to know what's in there, okay? I'm just kidding. There's just blocks like I told you and you hit like this coin and they all turn into like star bits, so that's like it. So now we're gonna like get this okay. I'll stop. <laughs> Anyways, for the secret mission, you're gonna need a shell. Shell power. Dun, dun, dun. So yeah, you're gonna need a shell. And Okay, yeah, you're gonna grab a shell and not jump off the ledge, so don't do what I did. <laughs> oh my god, that was so weird, I just, like, I jumped off. Wow. So, yeah, once you have a shell, you come up here, and then you're gonna shoot it at this treasure chest. Now, the first part of this isn't really that hard. There's the star. So, you're going to need a catacrox to get up here, but, you know, I'm too pro. I can just, like, wall jump up there. I mean, triple jump. Ta-da! And when you get this... Yes, yes. First time getting the ice flower. Oh yeah, ice flower. You can walk on. Uh, wa you can wall jump off waterfalls and uh, make. Um, what is it? You can freeze water. So that's the ice flower. Nothing special. All right. The first part isn't that hard, but the second part is kind of annoying. You gotta make sure. Cataclax doesn't fall in the water. Like, god damn it. Okay. So, you're gonna make sure he doesn't fall in the water. Make sure he keeps up with you. And he fell in the water. Why wouldn't he fall in the water, right? And of course. Okay. He just drowns. Okay. Let's go. Try to get this guy over here without making him fall in the water. Nicely done, Nintendo Jaden! Alright guys, this is all the time I have with you today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, please remember to comment, like, subscribe. Helps me out a ton. Means a lot to me. A ton. I'll subscribe back to you if you subscribe to me. Check out your channel. We can become YouTube buddies. Anywho, this is it for me. Stay tuned tonight for 3D Land Part 6. And this is Nintendo Jaden signing out. Peace. Yes, I'm going to really quit.